Stupid which is okay. Mr. Mackey. He's a pacifist, I think. He got six. He wouldn't be Mackey. At least not what I think. My honest opinion, it wouldn't be Mackey. This doesn't seem correct. Okay, disc two going in. Is that Cartman? What the hell? Yeah, Cartman seems to steal the spot with another disc. Cartman, Cartman, we're going down to Cartman land. It is Cartman land, we are going to Cartman land. <laughs> going down to South Park, going down to South Park. Na, 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 This is the second season, by the way. Weak? You say weak? See what I think you said? Hold on, what? You just said the C word. Did I? <laughs> Did I? What the hell? And then finally, this. Oh, by the way, sorry for my ratings. These are all 9.2. And that's because of lack of special features. Disc 3, Better House by 1998 to 1999. Okay, well, this disc doesn't have some special features. Well, it's gonna just be a huge letdown. If none of the discs have any features. So, yeah, I like special features, guys. So, if a disc don't have features, you're gonna lose points on my rating scale. So, by episode 15 of my. So my ritual escape of DVD menu reviews that should already be sorted out. That should already know how the system works.
Can't get it. Okay, here I got it. I got it. I got it. Let's see why this this type case pissed me off. Well, there's additional bonus features, but again, they're probably gonna put on the third disc. Oh, now they put special features with blasters. Well, going down the south. I can't go to the first part of every day. Oh my god, this is so long. I'm supposed to be reference to gay fish. So, for a so this entire season set, I will be giving a rating of 8.1. 8.1. I take marks off of the lack of special features and the menus being stock, as in just standing there. The transition towards the actual menu UI are good. But uh, yeah, so now we're getting into the last of it. This is gonna be a long ass video, guys. Well, it's a day in the life of a DVD menu reviewer. So, yeah. let's do this pickle me three and then I'll do a close for our season set. So this is Despicable Me 3. I saw this in the theater last year. It includes all new mini movie. Well, the nation who brought movie goers Despicable Me and Despicable Me 2 and the used to animated hill 2015 Minions 2015 Minions continues the story of Gru, Lucy, the adorable daughters, Mar Margo, Edith, and Agus. And the Minions in Despicable Me 3 after his fight from the anti government for failing to take down Bad Bathazar Brat. The latest bad guy to turn humanity, Gru finds himself in the midst of a major identity crisis, but one of his dear strangers shows up to inform Gru that he has a long lost twin brother, a brother who desperately wishes to follow in his prince twin's despicable footsteps. One the former school will rediscover just how good it feels to be bad. Legend features mini movies, Super Life of Kyle. Not someone like this. Minion moments, deleted scenes and character profiles and more. The disc works exactly like the Speckle Me too, except that that one was orange and this one was blue. I'm already going to dock points just for that. Shit. 
There's only gonna be a fast one because there's only one desk involved. Oh yeah, I need to pop right now with that shit. What's the timer? Fifty six minutes. Oh shit. My god, I think this one's going nuts. My god. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm going to dock even more points because they're numbering the scenes instead of giving them a, a good title. So yeah, I, I have to give it a 7.1, yeah, the actual movie itself gets a 10 for me, but we're reviewing the, the menu, not the actual movie itself, so, and for this final one, I'm just too easy to flip the camera, Star Wars, three discs, Star Wars. I'll only be showing you guys the first disc and the final disc because I'm lazy. Please, season five. And the Clone Wars. And then, kind of do also Arnold Stein again. Last of the past. And then, once this video is uploaded, I'll review this. Anniversary motion picture of Titanic. With copyright. Probably gonna give me a notice, not an infringement, but a notice. And I'm probably gonna do a cover. I'm gonna eat first. I'm gonna review the CD. What the hell? That was fast, I know. But I'm trying to get through this pretty quick here. So. Oh, and here's the final disc. I should show them proper. Oops. And I dropped it. Waiting for that, so. 
Right now, it's like a three-second season of Spider Man SquarePants is in the lead at this point. So yeah, because it's just a better way to make a season set, in my honest opinion. I feel like at the end of the Clone Wars and something, then you're going to an ending where Anakin's eyes briefly went yellow. As a kind of nod to the fact that he will become Darth Vader. Well, I don't have time for this bullshit. Same rating, 7.1. Clone Wars season set, 7.1. The main reason why I went for this season was the back of the box shows Palpatine fighting Darth Maul as Savage Opress. Right there, can you see that? Yeah. Here's up front, by the way. It's old Jedi Obi Wan bullshit themed cockamamie ass. So. Now it's time for Back to the Past, The Haunting Hour. Final DVD menu on the list. Jesus Christ. And I'll rank all of these and tell you why I rank them like that. So yeah. Oh, so he's gonna f kill him. Uh, I just 
Like, the thing came after him and gave him his friggin' hat back. And then decided to try to eat him. Like, what the shit? I give this a good fallen 10 out of 10. Now, where the hell is the case for? Where did I leave it? Oh, wait. Oh, there it is. So, I'm now gonna bring you over to the ranking, rank, ranking bed. Where I rank these things so you guys can see what I'm doing. So, this is how I'm gonna rank these things. Number one and the champion of DVD menu reviews 15 is Nickelodeon SpongeBob SquarePants, the complete second season winner. Second place goes to The Simpsons 18th season. Fourth place goes to South Park, the complete second season. Goes third place. Then fourth place, fourth place will be The Haunting Hour, fifth place will be The Clone Wars, and then sixth place will be The Spiritual Me 3. So I suggest picking up these DVDs here, and maybe that one, but basically, yeah. Because this is the overall. Better way to do a season set, and the other DVDs are just downright inferior. So, so now I gotta do this bitch. Zippy zippy. Oh, the crunch noise. I mean, freak's sake. I saw myself there. What? That concludes DVD menu reviews 15. So, uh, shit. it concludes it on a fairly high note. Ah, uh, shit. Can see what I'm doing for shit. So yeah, bye guys, bye guys, um, I'm gonna eat, upload this, actually, sorry, I'm gonna upload this video, I'm gonna eat, then I'm gonna review this, Titanic Anniversary CD soundtrack, and then I'm gonna do an MLP cover, so yeah, so stay tuned guys, bye guys, bye guys, make sure to subscribe, hit the bell icon, get the notifications coming straight to your inbox, and yeah, so yeah, Nikos, it's Nikos XP, out. Bye, guys.